So five months ago, I celebrated my 26th birthday and I never uploaded the vlog. I did take some footage and I just want to put it together and have a video to remember forever. Miguel makes all of my birthdays special and this one was no exception. I was gifted my very first designer bag for my birthday. So I want to show you guys the moment and then after I'm going to do an unboxing to show you guys which bag I got. Babe, give me a birthday message. Okay, good morning. Today is May 18th and today is Jelka's birthday. My sweet froggy, my sweet love. She woke up like another monkey this morning, just like this. I just wanna say happy birthday, my love. She hasn't brushed her teeth in like three weeks. <laughs> so it's did. pretty stinky. But I just love her so much and I'm very happy for her. And yeah, I just wish you the best for you and us. Chapter 26. 26. It's a new chapter. We'll see what happens. First birthday freebie. Okay, okay. Free birthday tree. Five count nugget. Wow. Morning. Morning. Good morning. We have a birthday girl, so. Trying to get my rewards. Angelica? Alright, your total is zero dollars. Thank, okay, so thank you so much. Okay, we got free chicken minis. No, not chicken minis. Nuggets. And they show the frosted coffee. Frosted That's coffee. the birthday treat. Birthday treat. So, we just got back from getting my free Chick-fil-A treat. Um, we just wanted to get something to hold us over until we go to brunch at 12.30. I just put this Cetaphil sunscreen all over my entire face. This is like my primer every day because it makes my face so smooth and a little bit dewy and it's sunscreen protection obviously. And then LA Girl Truly Matte Foundation on top. I've been trying, I've only tried this a couple times. This is newer to me and so far it's okay. I would say the Wet n Wild foundation is still my number one. I'm gonna use this NYX HD concealer for concealing. This Milani for brightening. Well, my mom called me so I just got ready with her on FaceTime um, for my birthday. I figured that would be a little bit more special. So sorry I didn't get to record, but I just did my lip. So my makeup is complete. I used the Murillo Twins on my lips, and then I did a little smoky eye with some Anastasia Beverly Hills products. I have Kiss lashes on. So this is the base. Twenty-six birthday brunch OOTD. Gold strappy heels, this backless champagne dress, Kim K inspired hair, gold jewelry. So cute. I'm in my pretty girl era. We are in Nordstrom's right now and I had to buy some sandals because those heels were killing me. But now we're going to go check out the Louis bags and see if they have the one that I want. And if they do, I'm getting it for my birthday. Okay, you guys. So I apologize for being extremely backlit. I've had curtains. They're actually sitting behind there. Um, I've had them for months. Actually, I bought those on my birthday as well, or like right before. But we've had a problem getting them hung because our ceilings are so high in this house and you can't see it here, but they're extremely high and they, I don't know what it's called, where they have this shape. So it's just been 
a little bit difficult, but we're working on it. You guys saw my vlog for my birthday, going out to dinner, and then we went to go get this bag. So I actually went in there looking for another bag, but they didn't have it, and I'm actually really glad that they didn't because I feel like this one is much more classic and less trendy. So this is my new baby I tried to wrap it up like they do in the store but I've been wearing it so it's not exactly um, perfect so in the bag there's this little um, receipt and my sales associates card and then I'm going to open her up this is like the most surreal experience ever every time i open it i'm just like why like i used to watch unboxing videos all the time and see girls with their designer bags and i knew one day i was gonna have my moment so here we are this is the louis vuitton speedy 20 mm so it's not the mini it's one above I think I don't know honestly like don't quote me on any of this I'm not like well versed in the designer bag world but I just love her I feel like she's a classic I wanted the monogram print for my first bag I just feel like it's so classic I love wearing it with white and then it does come with this beautiful strap um, that you can like multi-purpose into many things so it can be a shoulder bag, It can I can stretch it out and make it crossbody, or I could wear it without the strap. Um, I do both. I wear the strap when I want to be more casual or, you know, like airports or, you know, things like that where you're not as, like, nice or dressed up. Um, and then I've worn it a couple times just as a wrist bag or just a handbag. Um, but the most common way that I've been wearing it is with some gold chains that I actually got on Amazon. So I will show you guys what's in my bag, how I put it together, and how I've been wearing it. Okay, before I get started, I forgot to show you guys this little pouch that it came with, which is so cute um, to put your travel jewelry in. But it comes with another little card, but the best part is... It comes with a lock and key, which is so cute. I think it's so cute to like repurpose this onto like a necklace or a belt um, or use, you know, the keys for anything. But obviously it's to lock up your bag like when you're traveling and things. Um, so I have been keeping this because it's so cute. The first thing that I did when I got my new bag was... I purchased a insert to go inside um, and it just looks like this it's like felt and then it also came with a little middle part that velcros in there's some things in here because like I said I've been using it so I already have like a bunch of hair ties in this pocket let's put it in so this is gonna protect the inside if anything should Bill. It's just gonna, you know, maintain your bag for longer and it also helps with the shape of the bag. Um, it helps keep that nice, pretty, speedy shape because the insert is pretty stiff. And then this goes in the middle. There's quarters in here for when I get my groceries from all these. If you know, you know. And then, of course, my wallet and my key. So that's gonna go in the front. And then I always have lip liners. This is Beauty Creations and LA Girl. And then I have a Maybelline Lifter Gloss. I usually have like whatever lip I'm wearing for the day or I always have just extra lippies in here just in case. Um, EOS Chapstick. And then this Chanel Rouge Cocoa Balm. This is what I'm wearing today. So I have this in there and then I have a hand sanitizer. I have a million of these just lying around my house from like stocking stuffers, gifts. As you can see, this one was from a bachelorette party. So this is the one I'm using right now. Hand sanitizer always and then my sunnies. 
can throw them in there and then why i ultimately decided to go with this bag over like the little shoulder strap bag is because i can just throw my phone in there and keep it pushing my other shoulder bags it was like i could squeeze my phone in there but i would kind of have to like take it out move things around so ultimately i decided to go with this one and i feel like it's so timeless and i've actually seen that it's coming back this fall on pinterest like all it's all over um maybe because i'm searching it a lot or maybe because it's in style i don't know but i'm just really happy that i got this one the next thing that i purchased to accessorize my bag with are these chains from amazon they have little hooks on them i've been using the shortest one as a little accessory in the front like this which i think is so cute and it kind of ties in um i've been using this like medium sized one to make it a shoulder bag which i am loving so I've been wearing it like this. I feel like it makes it a little bit more classy. It makes it a little bit more um, like, you know, styling it up. I think it goes so much better with like when I wear outfits like this. Like I'm still wearing jeans. I'm still casual. But it just makes it look a little bit nicer and a little bit more fun. And it also makes it look a little bit different from what everyone else is doing. So this is how I've been liking wearing my Speedy. And then I will bring out the strap when I'm dress a little bit more casual or want a crossbody or you know when it when it matches um the strap and everyone's always telling me like oh your bag's open your bag's open but I never use the zipper if I'm being honest maybe I should that, I'm sure that would help with the shaping but I literally never use um the zipper to close it I just leave it open that way it's just easy to grab things in and out but yes, this is my baby girl. This was my 26th birthday present from my Miguel. I love him so much. So I just wanted to quickly show you the outfit that I'm wearing. I have little Dolce Vita heels on, some Abercrombie jeans, and this new top from H&M that I just got in. And I wanted to show you how the bag goes with white. So nice. Um, but yes, thank you so much for watching and experiencing my birthday vlog with me, even though it's five months late, but it's better late than never. I want to have this video on here forever. I'll see you next time.